Ever wondered how thongs evolved over time? Let's dive into the fascinating backstory of this minimalist undergarment. The history of thongs traces back to ancient civilizations. In the land of the pharaohs, the Egyptians were known to sport these undergarments, although their versions were a far cry from the sleek designs we see today. Fast forward to the 14th century AD, and we find thongs being utilized in a rather unexpected arena, sumo wrestling in Japan. Here, the thong was more than just an undergarment. It was a functional piece of attire that allowed for greater mobility while maintaining modesty. So you see, the thong has always been more than just a fashion statement. It served practical purposes in various cultures and societies throughout history. The thong we know today has evolved significantly over the centuries, adapting to changing tastes, needs, and fashion trends. So, the thong has a history that stretches back centuries and it's not all about fashion. Fast forward to the 20th century, when thongs started to make a splash in the fashion world. The reintroduction of this minimalistic undergarment took place in the 1939 World's Fair, where the innovative designer Fiorenzo Sorsinelli showcased the reimagined thong, sparking intrigue and conversation. As the decades rolled on, the thong began to gain traction, particularly in the 1970s and 80s. The beaches of South America, particularly Brazil, became a hotbed for the thong bikini, transforming it from a simple piece of underwear into a bold fashion statement. Pop culture too played a significant role in the rising popularity of the thong. Who can forget the catchy lyrics of Cisco's hit song, Thong Song? The tune became an anthem of sorts, further propelling the thong into the limelight. By the end of the 20th century, the thong had secured its place in women's fashion, a testament to its versatility, style, and the changing attitudes towards body positivity and self-expression. Entering the new millennium, the thong continued to evolve, both in design and perception. As the early 2000s rolled in, thongs began to symbolize more than just a fashion statement. They became an emblem of sexual freedom and empowerment, reflecting the changing societal norms of the era. The design of thongs also saw a transformation. We saw the rise of the G-string, a more minimalistic version, and the C-string, an even bolder and more provocative design. These variations mirrored the changing trends and preferences of the time, showing us that fashion is indeed a reflection of society. However, this evolution wasn't without controversy. Debates arose around thongs, touching on issues of comfort, health, and objectification, some questioned the health implications of wearing thongs, while others criticized them for objectifying women. Despite these debates, thongs have remained a popular choice for many women around the world. What does the future hold for thongs? As we stand on the precipice of tomorrow we can't help but wonder what lies ahead for our beloved thongs. Current fashion trends seem to be veering towards a blend of comfort and style, which could mean that the thongs of the future will be even more comfortable than they are today. With the wave of body positivity flooding the fashion industry, we may also see a shift in thong designs, embracing all body types and shapes. This is certainly a refreshing and much-needed change in the right direction. Moreover, the growing trend of sustainable and ethical fashion is also making its mark on the production of thongs. As consumers, we are becoming more aware of our environmental footprint, and this consciousness is reflected in our shopping habits. In conclusion, as we've seen, the thong has come a long way. From its ancient origins to its place in modern fashion, it has evolved and adapted to changing times and trends. Who knows what the future holds for this iconic piece of clothing,